in this concept of mixtures and allegation one small topic is a successive removal and replacement type if any question you can see this type okay this formula I'll explain later first you can go through this problem you understand or not to check it once a container has 1000 liters of wine okay just i'm showing diagram here this is one container 1000 liters of wine 100 liters of wine is drawn from the container and filled with water so from this 100 ml uh, uh, wine is drawn out so it's taken out from this and again that uh, gap is filled with water this process is done two more times what is the ratio between the wine and water in the final mixture okay first 100 ml is removed from this uh, 1000 liters of uh, wine the same 100 ml water is the poured the filled out again separately again one more 100 ml is drawn from this second time when you are taking in there some content of water also mixed so that means if you apply this formula how to use so it is a f is equals to i into 1 minus r by n whole power n i is the initial quantity f is the final quantity r is the removal quantity n is the number of process so this one let me show with formula here easy if you want final quantity of the wine so how much first uh, how much quantity of the wine is remain in the glass in the thousand liters what we need to find out so for that f is equals to i into 1 minus this is 1 minus r by i all to the power n so according to this problem initial quantity so initially starting is 1000 liters so 1000 uh, liters no yes the container has 1000 ml actually not 100 liters of wine is drawn okay any number in this question is 1000 liters 100 liters is drawn every time just example i'm showing ml okay. just consider this is a uh, 1000 milliliters and 100 ml is drawn okay 1 minus r by i so in this problem r is removal quantity every time we are removing 100 by i i is again 1000 it is done three times so total first is done and this process is done two more times so total three times so if you do calculation after doing three times how much first two if you take out only 900 ml is remain right again next time if you take 100 ml means not 800 because in that extra 100 ml water and wine is mixed up that's why you should not confuse here we can apply formula so 1000 this 100 times so 10 1 minus 1 by 10 so 10 minus 1 so 9 by 10 whole power 3 so 1000 into 9 by 10 9 cube by 10 cube 9 cube is 729 by 10 cube is 1000 so cancel this 1000 729 ml is the final quantity after doing three process three steps without seeing the formula if you take for example 900 800 700 only should come so it should not be 729 ml is the wine asking the question ratio between wine and water so 729 out of 1000 remaining is the water Okay, 1000 minus 729 is 271. So 729 is to 271 is the ratio between wine and water. So this actually process means three times we are taking. The meaning is first uh, every time indirectly 10% out of 1000 according to this problem. 100 ml we are taking means okay, so 10% will be removed from that. So first from 1000, 100 is removed. Okay, so the wine quantity will be balanced 900. Second time out of this 900, again 10% only they removed. Not exactly 100 ml. 100 ml means 100 ml removing, but in that some water also is poured 900. So it's mixed up. 900 ml wine, 100 ml water. From the 1000 again removed 100. So 90 again 10%. So in 910 is 90. So that is 810. Okay, and third time from 810 again 10%. So 81. From 810, 810, 81 if you subtract 729. 
same will get so 729 will be balance of the wine in this 1000 ml after three steps because of uh, 100 we know 10 percent we are doing in case if for example they ask only 15 ml or some 2.5 ml they are removing those time we can apply this formula directly so just uh, i is the initial quantity r minus i r is the removal quantity by i and all for n n is the number of process how many times it was done so this also way one of the way if you know the percentage exactly how much they are removing or else you can apply the formula and we can get the ratio between those two